What's up, everybody? This is Master Ian Gamer, and welcome to the Overwatch 2 shop update for Tuesday, December 12th, 2023. Today, we have three new skins in the shop, along with a returning skin as part of a bundle. And first up, we have Festive Kiriko. Yes, one of the hotly debated skin recolors for this season, where they took the existing Timekeeper Kiriko Legendary skin, recolored it into a red, green, and gold festive aesthetic, and this is what it looks like. Personally, I think it's pretty good. I, yeah, I'm i not against them recoloring skins as long as they handle it properly. I did a whole video basically talking about that, and this one I think is a fine example of how to properly recolor a Legendary skin and still make it look pretty good. We can take a close-up of the Suzu as well. I like the peppermint design on it. The Afuda has the little snowflake details on the back. And the Kunai is green. So yes, this isn't a part of a bundle or anything like that. It's just a skin on its own. 1900 Overwatch coins. But moving on, next up we have Nutcracker Farah. Again, a recoloring of an existing legendary skin. This time Farah's Enchanted Armor skin, which admittedly is one of her coolest skins. So of all the skins to recolor into a festive palette like this, I am glad they went with this one because it looks pretty cool. I think they do a good job of invoking the idea of like a weird Christmassy spirit type thing. It's a fun design. I like it. Close up of the weapon as well. And of course, just like the Kiriko skin, this is not part of a bundle. It's a skin being sold on its own. So 1900 Overwatch coins for the skin. Third, though, we get the Cartographer May bundle featuring the Cartographer May epic skin. One of the skins fitting of the Call of the Hunt theme for this season. This time, May being a cartographer. Wow, who would have guessed from the name of the skin? Close up of the weapon. I quite like the wood detailing on this skin and a lot of these Call of the Hunt skins. Very primitive, primal sort of look. I think it's neat. And along with the skin itself, we also get the Compass Weapon Charm. Find your way, etched on the back. The Cartographer May Player Icon. And the Charted Spray. And this entire bundle is 1200 Overwatch coins. And also worth taking a look at, I suppose, is the Cyber Devil Widowmaker bundle, which is making a return. Technically, you could already buy this skin just in the Hero Gallery, since all Season 1 and 2 skins do seem to be permanently available in the Hero Gallery at this point, which is an interesting decision on Blizzard's part. But nonetheless, they brought back the bundle as well, so if you wanted to get the skin and some of the additional charms and whatnot that come with it, the Cyber Widow Weapon Charm, the Cyber Devil Player Icon, and the Cyber Devil Spray. You could get them all as part of a bundle, but otherwise you could just buy them individually in the Hero Gallery. And that does it for today's shop update. Thank you all so much for watching. Definitely let me know your thoughts on these skins in the comments down below. Are any of them ones you're interested in picking up for yourself, or are you gonna save your coins for something better later down the line? Either way, be sure to subscribe, hit up that bell icon, come follow me on X, and join my Discord server to hang out and never miss any of my future Overwatch content. Special thanks to my YouTube channel members who help make these videos possible, and if you'd like to join them to earn some cool rewards, then just hit that join button down below. Otherwise, this is Master Ian Gamer signing off, and until next time, have a great day.